गुड इवनिंग ऑल टुडे वी विल बी स्टडिंग हाउ टू क्रिएट रिपोर्ट इन लैटेक्स वी नीड टू क्रिएट अ रिपोर्ट इन लैटेक्स सो टू डू दैट वी विल रिक्वायर अ वर्ड टू लैटेक्स सॉफ्टवेयर यू कैन डाउनलोड इट फ्रॉम द लिंक्स विच आई हैव प्रोवाइडेड इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन आई एम कॉपिंग द फर्स्ट लिंक विल फर्स्ट डाउनलोड द सॉफ्टवेयर So you can download it. It is just a five MB software. I have already I have already downloaded it. It is on my desktop. So I will just extract it. Now that software is available on my desktop. So it is a simple setup. You have to just double click it. I have already installed it, so I will not be showing how to install it. It is simple, so I will just open the software. It is Word to Latex. You will be seeing a user interface like this. So what we have to do? We have to first create a report in Word doc, Word format. So I have created my own report in Word format. So I have completed my whole report in Word first. you can see the table of contents also so once finished with the report in word as you can see this is a word file dot docx so as input i have to provide that word file i will just go to desktop select my word file the code that is report dot docx now we will have to save the output in some folder so i will create a folder named it as out take it so we will just select that folder where we want to save the output and we will give it a name like name or we can say report report dot text will be saved now we have we will have to just simply click the convert button now this conversion operation has been started so what it is giving it is giving a trial license has been expired error uh, as you will be downloading it at first time you will not be getting this error the the conversion the conversion will be completed and you will get a conversion completed message what you will be getting is you will be getting a dot txt file which i have uh, which i have already created and you will be getting some eps files so let's say uh, i have it here my word document being converted into uh, being converted using the word to latex software so what it will be returning it will be returning us this latex file we can open it with any of editor that we have let's say notepad so as you can see you cannot see the whole document very uh, properly here and you cannot even find out the dot pdf file of your report so what you will have to do you will have to first create an account on sharelatex.com so we will just hit sharelatex.com this is a website which enables us to create the latex so we will first register to the website so here i have already registered so i will just skip to login registration was so simple just give your mail id and password this is my mail id and password and logging in once logged in you can just click to new project and blank project give a name as report you can do anything i will just say all 
so this is all this project will be now this project is being opened i will first delete this text file now i have to upload here you can see a little upload button where you can upload all the files you can just drag and drop all your files here are my files so i will select all my files and just drag them here now as you can see all 18 files are being uploaded these files are of small 0.1 mb 1 mb at max so upload uploading will not be taking so much time we can tell all the files are being uploaded it might take more or less time depending upon your internet connection files are uploaded these are sorted by alphabetical manner so as you can see 1 2 3 4 five. they can be in order you need not to worry about it just open which your file you name as report this is our main file which contains total configuration so this is my total configuration as you can see now what we have to do we have to just hit this recompile button what it will be doing it will just convert this dot text file into pdf and display it here so i will just hit compile recompile sorry so this is text file and this is the pdf which is being generated actually it is a bigger document so it is taking so much time once compilation is completed this will load and as you can see as you can see the report is being generated exactly as i have i had it in word a small change as you can see a small drawback of using this method is that you need to you get so many spelling mistakes so you have to go through this text file and check where you have made a spelling mistake where the software has been, has made a spelling mistake and you have to just change it here you can see the spelling of bachelor is being click and rename i am selecting the whole string and right clicking you can get auto correct so this is being modified as you can see here the spelling of bachelor was wrong i have modified it and now i will recompile For recompiling i should be getting the new string which will be a correct spelling let's wait so here you can see bachelor of computer engineering is correct to do this you can just simply open your report and copy paste each and every line and you can if you if you get any mistakes you can just paste it here if you get any mistakes anywhere in your 
report you can just copy paste it from your original report that is doc this is necessary as you required to provide this dot text file to the university as you have completed uh, as to display that you have completed the reporting latex as you can see the table of contents are also properly initialized here so this is how you will be creating your reporting word sorry in latex from word to latex do not forget to like my video and comment if you have any other problems thank you